know that voice. It's you. You're the one who's been guiding us. Um. I am your ancestor from a time long ago. You look like a villain. <laughs> Oh, so Zelda is a sage. Okay. The demon king will return. The magic binding him will be undone. When that time comes, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. Link will only succeed with Dorito's help. Summon the winds and support this hero. It was clear. Tulin just says no, I don't wanna. What's gonna happen then? So it's my mission to fight the Demon King with you? Blink! This is so, so amazing! I can't believe my ancestor gave me such an important mission, and it involves fighting alongside you to save the world! Look! Check out what I can do now! Ah! 
Um, you got some little ghost of yourself? I can summon his ghost apparently. <laughs> you can use that ring to call on my power anytime, alright? Okay, let's head back to the village and tell Dad. I don't know if there's any cut the cutscene is gonna keep going, but I have like some thoughts on what just happened. Is it ever gonna stop loading? Alright, it did. Cool. Nice. Really glad I didn't start like exploring this region before I shut down the blizzard. That would have been a nightmare. You guys, you did it! Okay, so it's not a cutscene, it's a... Okay. It's been so long my controller went to sleep. Okay. I have a question. I'm, I'm okay with the fact that Zelda got sent back into time and she became a sage and she's apparently like the, the sixth sage and the sage of time. I'm okay with all of that. But the question I have is... Why did they make Tulin? Why not just use Teba? Why not just like you come back to like the little village and Teba's the one that helps you through that entire thing instead of um instead of uh, making Teba's kid like Tulin? Which is kind I just kind of weird. I don't have a problem with it, but I just I just want to know why. Because they introduced they just sidelined Teba. So either we we have like three more regions to go. So either like all in the all of the regions they have like they each have a new Champion that becomes sage, or like like for instance, Sidon's gonna have like a kid, or Sidon's gonna like somebody else from Sidon's race is gonna be the sage instead of Sidon, or like Tibba's the only one that got shacked in this entire like sage thing. I, I I wonder which one's gonna be. I like if they did it for Tibba, they gotta do it for everybody else, right? They have to introduce a new character from every region to become the sage. Otherwise, I don't know what what the point is to 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 all of this. Like, why if I you keep the the other three, but you just get rid of uh, Teva for some reason? Was Teva like hated for some reason? I don't know. I I don't, I don't know. You guys, you did it. Yeah, it turns out it's easy once you start working together. Hmm. This was no small feat. 
I guess I guess you can't believe the stonework art from the children's songs was real. Me either. You should have knocked me over with a feather. You could have knocked me over with a feather. For a job well done, Tulin. Wait, what? This ball meant so much to you, and now you're giving it to me? It was always my intention to give it to you once you came of age as a warrior. Uh, how can I get this ball? Dad? Thank you. I'll prove to you that I become a warrior worthy of carrying it. Uh, can I have that ball, please? Hey, Link, that woman in the vision my ancestor showed us, didn't she look just like Princess Zelda to you? Do you think that was a real princess? I mean, it seems like a long, long time ago. There's still a bunch of unanswered questions. I'd rather really know more about the figure we saw in the storm wind arc, so I'm gonna go look into it personally. Next time you see me, I have more information about Princess Zelda, so check in with me sometimes, okay? And remember, with my sage's power, the two of us can keep working together no matter what. Vow of Tulin, Sage of Wind. Proof of Vow of Tulin, Sage of Wind. Use it to summon uh, or dismiss the avatar of Tulin. How do I how do I summon this uh, this Tulin? Tulin of Reed Hope Village. Complete. You can activate the active procedures of law on key items menu. Okay. Hey, can I have your bow? I keep getting stronger and stronger until the day comes when we can fight together again. I'm the descendant of the Sage of Wind, after all. I'm not going to be the one who holds you back, Link. I'm worried, uh, about, Prin I'm worried about Princess Zelda too, so I'll keep looking uh, into things from the descent. Alright, so I guess this is the end. Okay, so this region is completely opened up now. That's cool. So hold on, hold on. If I do this... No, that's not the ability. How do I... Dismiss, summon... You can't summon here. How do I summon then? I thought I can have like uh, Tulin's ability whenever I want now. Okay, so Tulin's not here to help me fight or anything. He is not. Hold on. Okay, that's not how you summon. How do I summon the sage? I can't summon here. Okay. Um, how do I summon the... I don't really know how do I summon the... Um, the um, how do I summon the sage? How do I summon him? Because like his ability to like the, the gust ability is actually pretty good. How do I summon him? I thought this might be the summon ability, but it's not. Okay, so how do I summon him? This was weird.
How do I summon them? It keeps telling me I can't summon. I can't summon here. Where can I summon them? Like, I'm not in combat or anything. Do I have to be like next to Tulin to summon to summon it? I don't know. Oh, I remember this one. I remember this thing here. This is a Korok, right? Yeah. Fight happening? What was that music? Do the shrine first. Go to the dismiss summon. Did I summon you? I can summon here. It keeps saying I can summon here. Alright, Korok Seed. I can't- you can summon here. I don't understand. Uh, I'll do the shrine later. I just want to activate it. Yeah, I don't understand this. Um, do I have to talk to Tulin? A knight? I don't know. They're sounding the same thing. Cool. Alright, I don't have to wear the, uh, the worm outfit anymore. Give me the damage up. Alright, you have a quest. I'm gonna mark it and come back later for it. Right now, I just want to, uh, to figure out how the sage thing works. Do I have to talk to you? Hi, Elaine. Thanks to you. I've been rid of everything. So, getting back to normal. I'm looking to, uh, to lead from Zelda. I'll let you right and live. They go nowhere. Oh, yeah. One other thing. I don't think it has anything to do with where the princess is, but uh, hard to ask me to help him uh, source some ancient literature. you never believe I found written this in his books. Uh, Standa, Glupa, and the Shuffle's hidden treasures sleeps the center of the three secret hot springs in the mountains. Guide the three waters to the place uh, when it's filled, the slumbering treasures as will awaken once more. There's gotta be something good waiting whoever solves the riddle, right? A secret hot spring, huh? I mean, uh, send the uh, secret hot spring a few times as northwest of the little village. It's the best, a quick, a quick soak, enough to heal your wounds and blink of eye or keep you from freezing too. But I don't know about the others, the Herbal Mountains are a big place, I'm not sure we could, uh, could, we could cover all of them. Uh, but the slumbering treasure is pretty tempting, but only we could find it. Oh, that's a side quest. Hmm. 
Okay, how do I... Why can't I summon the sage? Like, I'm right next to Tulin now. Can I summon it here? I can't summon here. I, I, I don't understand. Um... Try reloading your game. Okay. Title screen, I guess? 